One of the most important concepts we need to understand in mass transfer is the concept of a phase. What is a phase? Remember that there are some phases that are states of matter, but not all the phases will be state of matter, okay? A phase of matter is characterized by having relatively uniform chemical and physical properties. I know this is very ambiguous, but bear with me. Phases are different from states, okay? So a phase is not always the same as a state, and states will not always be phases. The states of matter, you already know them, is liquid, solid, gas, maybe even plasma, and so on. Those are states of matter, but also considered phases. But matter can exist in different phases, yet remain in the same state of matter. For instance, Let's assume liquid, liquid, liquid one with liquid two. This is a, the most classic example I will show you is the mixture between oil and water. You know that they, if you let them be, time passes by, water will go down and the oil remains on the top. Clearly two phases. Therefore, even though they are in the same state of matter, which is liquid, they are two phases, and you can assume that there are interesting things happening in the connection, or let's say in the interface between the water and the oil. So I, this is very important. It's a very simple concept, yet a very powerful one, because later on, especially when we are talking about liquid-liquid extraction or vapor-liquid, or you're talking about vapor, vapor liquid liquid is another very interesting one. You will need to understand that we're talking about the phases and not states of matter.